Hey guys, it's Cameron here at the Adams Family Pokemon Channel. Today I am back with another awesome dollar store pack opening video. Um, I think we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 total packs to open today. Um, so I drove all around, found the ones that I could find it. I think I found these between two dollar stores. I found these at one and the Forbidden Lights at another. So we got one... Uh, evolutions pack. Let's go ahead and get on into this. Got our trusty handy dandy scissors for these guys here. So, this is our one and only evolutions pack for today. Let's go ahead and get right on into it. If we open up the pack art to us, we don't see what our stuff is. Keeps everything a surprise. Middle to the back. And let's flip it. So, we have a. Oh, oh, oh. Come on, camera. A Pikachu. A Haunter. And we have a Reverse Weedle. Nice. So we got our first hit for the Dollar Store Packs for tonight. Let's see if we can keep that rolling with Celestial Storm. Again, guys, if you guys uh, are new to the channel, you can go ahead and go back a few videos to the Ultra Prism Box video where I said that I had a card giveaway. I'm giving away a Machamp Break card as well as a bundle of code cards. So once the channel hits 100 subscribers, we will be... Um, doing oh i'll be going back to that video and choosing a random winner um so the details for that giveaway are in that video so we have a spinner rack a bill's maintenance and a reverse marsh stomp nice so let's go ahead and go through with our next celestial storm pack and see what we can get bum ba -da dum bum bum So middle to the back, don't fat finger the tiny stack, we have a shove it, a fighting energy, and a Deoxys non-hollow rare. I guess I can consider that a pull because you know it's a rare and you're not guaranteed anything out of these. So when you get a rare it's kind of cool. Alright, on to the next Celestial Storm pack. Let's get right on into it. Rayquaza art. Boo. Here you go. Middle to the back. Don't fat finger the stack. Got a Torchic. A Lizia. I think that's how you say that. And a Reverse Mudkip. Nice. Keep the pulls coming for tonight. Um... Again, guys, uh, I uh, have a card giveaway going on. It's for a Machamp Break card. If you go back to my Ultra Prism video again, you can see the details on how to get entered into that giveaway. Once the channel reaches 100 subscribers, I will go and pick a winner, and then we will all have a wonderful time with some code cards and a Machamp Break. So we have a Cacnea, a Huntail, and a Love Disc. Now we are on to Forbidden Light. Can't wait till they start putting unbroken bonds out in these. If they do, that would be amazing. I would just <laughs> buy an entire box and do like one massive Dollar Tree opening of unbroken bonds packs. That would be super cool. Company, Pokemon Company International, if you're hearing me, do it. It'd be awesome. Everyone would love you forever. We have a Furfro. A Judge. And then we have a reverse clef key. Nice. So let's keep it on. Moving on down the road again. Moving on down the road again. One of these days I swear I'm going to cut a card and it's just going to be absolutely terrible. Junk to the ground there. We got our middle to the back. Don't fat finger the stack. We have a Snover, a Metal Frying Pan, and a Reverse Araquanid. Nice. Got some good hits on these Dollar Tree packs tonight. Well, these actually came from a family dollar, not a Dollar Tree. Um, I found out that the um, these packs come from Dollar General, Family Dollar, 
and Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree and Family Dollar both carry them in the boxes, uh, by the, these boxes, by the register. And then, um, oh, I always ask them, like, hey, this box is empty, can I grab it? <laughs> Especially if I'm, like, buying them out. Um, and then, uh, at Dollar General, they're actually hanging up on the toy aisle. So I found that those weird boosters I got back in a previous video where they were, um, had the little tag with the little hole in them where you could actually hang them up. That was actually from Dollar General. So we got four more after this one, so let's go ahead and flip it. So we got a Flabebe, a Tyrant, and our Reverse Tyrantum. Nice, that's a reverse rare. With tyrannical heart. Oh my goodness, aren't you so evil? That's a really cool looking artwork, honestly. Even though it's like that weird CGI 3D art. Still a pretty cool card. So we got four more Forbidden Light packs to go. Let's go ahead and see if we can't get this guy rolling on the road with a Greninja artwork. go junk and the pack to the trash middle to the back we have yet to pull an ultra rare or anything like that tonight yet so let's see if we can in these last packs get some last pack magic if not i will dip into my stack of sealed boosters for my hundred pack video uh unfortunately and then uh just open up one random pack so we got an heliolisk and then we have a reverse obama snow that's a reverse rare that's actually pretty cool so let's set the reverse rares to the side with the deoxys over there and then we got one oh uh, <laughs> one more three more forbidden light packs here to go so let's go ahead and scoop these guys on open most of the workers of the Dollar Trees and stuff around here they said that these guys don't really come in that often because for some reason they don't really sell that well um, I've been buying the, <laughs> the loads of them, so I don't, I don't understand. Um, but, um, hopefully they restock soon and I'm able to go pick up some more packs so I can keep the content coming for you guys. I like to open up regular boosters, but I like these dollar store boosters better because they honestly give you the best bang for your buck. Um, we have a Binnacle, then a Halucha. And a Reverse Esper. Nice. Check that out. Um, there are only three cards. You only, you know, it's only a dollar. You get three cards. You get an Ultra Rare that's worth like two or three or four or six dollars. You know, it just it seems to be a better bang for your buck. Um, one regular booster has ten cards. And they're generally, what, like four dollars or in some change at the store. If you get, you know, four of these... So 4 times 3 is 12, so you get 12 cards for $4. No guaranteed chance at anything, but you could get a bunch of, you know, hollows or what have you. And it's just, it's honestly a good, a good budget buy, especially if you're trying to, like, complete sets and for master sets and such and stuff like that. Junk and the pack to the side. And then, you know, you're able to just keep the content rolling and rolling and rolling. So we got our middle to the back, and then we flip it around. Don't fat finger the stack. We have a Finnegan. We have a Frogadilla. And then for our rare, which is actually a rare, we have a Hollow Magnazone. Check that guy out. That's awesome. So I think that's our first regular Hollow Rare of the night. So we'll uh, consider that our king so far. Last pack. Can we get some last pack magic, guys? That would be super awesome. If not, we're going to open up a random pack out of the boosters, and we're going to go ahead and I will do a fun little thing in the comments section below once I grab that box. If you guys have never seen it, it's a box full of random boosters from Sun and Moon and XY. Looking to build the collection of sealed stuff from Black and White, so once I get 100 total cards, or boosters, sorry, not cards, um, I will be um, doing a massive pack opening video. So if you, that's something you guys are interested in, stay forward to the channel. Hit that subscribe button. Hit the like button. A little bell notification so you know when I post a new video. Togepi, why are you going to sleep over there in the corner? And uh, we will get some awesome content coming for you guys in the coming weeks. First week of June, I'll be on um, vacation, fire energy, 
And uh, so not much content getting posted that week, but the week after, hopefully we'll have some good content. And our rare is, it's a Bunnelby, not a rare. So our last pack was a dud pack. So again, like I said, we are going to dive into the sealed box. Bum, ba, da, dum, bum, bum. So we got uh, a bunch of packs here. These are for my 100 pack video that I've been saving up for. It's really hard not opening all these guys. Um, so let's just go ahead and, for the sake of it, where is a Furious Fist? Dun, 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 dun. And it's a hair across art. So let's go ahead and get these guys all packaged back up back in here like so. That'll be coming for an awesome epic pack opening video later for you guys. There's a little sneak peek. So, XY Furious Fist. Not vintage. Super, not super, super old, but old enough. Contains a lot of the cards from my favorite Pokemon here, Heracross. So let's go ahead and get right into it. So this actually has a code card, unlike a lot of other things. Um, oh, that's a weird code card. Check that out. I've never seen one like that before. So check that out, guys. So we have XY, Furious Fists, unlocks one online booster pack. Does this count as a white and green code card? Because, or is this before any of that mattered? Um, comment below if you know what's going on and what's up with that. So let's go ahead and we'll flip this guy right here. There's a code card, Furious Fists, with no name. It's old enough to not have a name, which is super weird. So let's go ahead and... Make you work for that one. I'll leave it on the screen for just a couple more seconds. Bam! There you go. Since it's upside down, I'm going to make you guys work for it. So, XY, I think, is one, two, three to the front. Flip it. Let's hope I didn't screw that pack trip up. Pack trick up. So, we have a sparkling robe. A really cool Machoke art. He's, like, in icicles. He's like, ice. A Hitmonlee beating the crap out of a Machoke. <laughs> That's Machoke taking the ice bath after the beating from Hitmonlee. Um, then we have a Bill Sprout lost in the woods. A Lickitung splashing down the rapids. A Noibot. Chopinch in a sand trap. With Mountain Munch and Mud Slap. We have an Electabuzz. Our Reverse... Oh, I thought it was a rare. It's an Uncommon. Reverse Lilicky. Not much left for the imagination there. And our rare is a Noivern. A Holographic. Cool. So there we go, guys, with Boom Burst and Echolocation. Um, so that's cool. We got a hit out of it. It wasn't a hair cross like I want. I really want to get the full hair cross card set out of the Furious Fist set. So, um, but that's okay. We still got a nice hollow. Looks to be in really good shape. Um, too bad it's not quite. Well, the centering's actually kind of kind of good. Probably not enough to get it graded. I don't think this, these cards are old enough to be graded. But you know. That's alright. I'll eventually send some off to get graded. I still have to save up the money to get my PSA membership. Um, so real quickly, let's go over our pulls for the night, guys. So let's go through our reverses from our dollar store packs. We have an Esper. We have an Araquanid. We have an Eklefki. We have a Mudkip, a Marsh Stomp, and a Weedle from XY Evolutions. And then for our regular holo rares, uh, we have a Magnazone holographic. We have a Neuvern holographic, as well as for our reverse rares, which I also consider good pulls because they are a rare card. Um, we have our Tyrantrum reverse rare, our Obama Snow reverse rare, which it's it's odd that it's a grass type because it's it's an ice Pokemon. And Blessing of the Frost. Um, I never really understood that, you know, because it's a grass and an ice type Pokemon. So I, I don't, I don't really get that. But maybe it's just for the TCG. It just makes it 
simple enough, I guess. And then we have a non-hollow Deoxys rare, which is our only non-hollow rare of the night. So again, if you guys like today's video and you like the content in today's video, if you go ahead and hit that subscribe button as well as that thumbs up, that would be great because the bigger we can get the channel, the more content I'm able to get to you guys and the more content I'm able to get to you guys. And even just a little thumbs up helps more than you guys can even realize. So again, if you guys love today's content and would like to see more of it, please comment below and like and hit that subscribe button as well as a little bell notification so you can see when I post new content. If you guys would like to go ahead and um, go back to that, again, Ultra Prism video where I have the Machamp Break Card giveaway rules listed inside the video. You actually have to kind of watch the video to get the rules, but that's kind of how I set it up. It's kind of, you know, an incentive to actually want the card. Um, but... If you guys like today's video, again, like I said, go ahead, like, comment, subscribe, and this is Cameron from the Adams Family Pokemon Channel. Peace out.